Hello and salam everyone. Welcome to day 6 of the Ramadan workout series. Today we will be focusing on abs and arms. Okay, the upper body. So we, we, uh, I'm going to have like 5 exercises which are kind of like going to focus and work that upper body and the core. Okay, so quickly let's just start with the um, warm up and we'll get into the workout. So today we're going to do leg curls. We're going to start with leg curls. go 30 seconds make sure you're adding those arms reach and pull reach and pull keeping that core nice and engaged i know i say that a lot of times but that's important make sure your tummy is tucked in and nice and strong sorry yeah Okay, warming up those legs. Okay, let's just do a few high knees. You can add those arms. Keep going. Bring that knee towards the chest, pull it in, you got this, alternate legs, okay, let's switch, we got arm swings, keeping it nice and tall, going to warm up the Upper body. Okay. Arm opening. Crisscross. The other way. And center. Let's go. Crisscross. And center. And center. Crisscross. Center. And center. Make sure you're, you have your feet nice and wide. Let's stretch the ground once. You're gonna feel a good stretch in your back and the back of your legs. Feel it. You're gonna swing side to side. Oh, I love this stretch. Side to side. Good job. Last one. We're going to stretch those obliques. Center. Reach to the side. And center. Okay, let's get into the workout. Five exercises. You know how it is. Five exercises. Each exercise for 40 seconds. 20 second rest. Back to back five exercises. And then we're going to take a break of one minute. And we're going to repeat the whole circuit one more time and we're done. Okay, let's get into the first exercise. The first one is a shoulder tap. I'm just going to remove my glasses now. So the first one is going to be shoulder taps. For shoulder taps, all you have to do is get into a straight plank, a straight body from head to toe. And you're just going to tap your shoulder, right? You're going to tap that shoulder for 40 seconds. Okay. Let's go. Tap. Tap. Make sure the palms of the hand are underneath the shoulder. You're just going to tap the opposite shoulder. Keeping the core tummy tucked in. You can increase the distance between your legs to find more balance. Keep going and breathe normally. It's a shoulder tap. I don't want you to go up like this. I want you to be in a straight plank and tap those shoulders. Let's go. As many as you can. Okay. Drop those knees down. Next up is a knee push-up. So I want you to lie down on your tummy. Hands by your side. Okay. You're going to push those palms into the ground and you're going to get up. 
you're gonna come back down you're just gonna get up to your knees that's it right let's go let's go as many as you can in 40 seconds all you have to do is press those palms into the floor and push your body off the mat until your knees that's it you're gonna really work your arms and your chest I want you to keep those hands beside your chest keep it beside your chest let's go five more seconds you're gonna really feel the burn in your hands okay rest next exercise you're still going to be on your tummy just like so hands in front of you you're going to lift your back you're going to lift your chest up then you're going to squeeze and then you're going to reach back down you're going to go up and squeeze the shoulder blades okay let's go so this particular exercise is going to work your upper back so if you want a good posture if you don't want a hunch you want a good strong posture this is really going to make you look straight and upright you're going to pull those hands and elbows downwards you lift that chest off and it's a little tough but it's really good for your upper back posture okay rest ladies next up is a bear tap for the bear tap what you have to do is you're going to go on your fours and you're going to lift your knees up you see that and then you're just going to tap your knee see that that's it it's a good one let's go knees up you're going to tap make sure that you're forming an l with your legs so opposite knee you're going to tap the knees this is going to work your entire body your arms your legs your core everything stay there and just tap those who find this difficult can just stay like this don't move just stay like this okay others can just tap drop it rest oh my god that was a killer one make sure you form that l okay with the legs oh okay you're gonna rest last one is a plank we did a plank right you know what a plank is but we're gonna rock back and forth i'm gonna show you how so you're gonna get into a classic plank okay we are in a plank now right you're just gonna go front back do you see my feet they're just doing a slight motion you're just going back and forth that is it those who can't do this can obviously drop those knees down and do this right others can just lift and do this it's going to really burn those shoulders it's going to give you strong shoulders keep going and it's also going to work your tummy your core so it's a very good exercise beginners drop and do this okay ladies rest finish the five exercises we're gonna rest those of you who are not fasting can drink your water take a break we're gonna complete the whole circuit again in one minute okay catch that breath i'm fasting ignore this yeah ignore this one we're gonna start in 30 seconds get ready you know what to expect right shoulder taps this is the first one starting in 20 seconds 15 okay let's get ready for shoulder taps i'm gonna go on the mat extend let's go tap Tap. make sure your feet are nice and wide so that you find a nice balance and i want you to do this very slowly so that your body is straight 
and you have a nice balance on the ground right so like if you're going to keep your feet wide apart you will have more balance and more support you can do that but make sure you're doing this slowly i don't want you to swing your body like this don't do that you have to keep it nice and straight you're just going to bend those elbows to touch the shoulder that is it keeping the core nice and tight tuck that tummy in suck it in okay rest next up kneeling push up you're going to work your upper body lie on your tummy hands beside your bust your chest Let's go. Push and up. Push the palm into the ground and up. Use all the energy you've got. Push and go up. Hands beside the chest. Press the palms into the ground. Lift that body off the mat. As many as you can, ladies. As many as you can. Rest up. Next one is swimmers. Hands in front of you. Let's go. Pull those elbows towards the waist. Pull those hands towards the chest. You're going to squeeze the shoulder blades. So you're going to really work your posture. You want a straight back. You don't want to hunch. You do this. Lift your chest off the mat. Up, up, up. Hold it. So you're going to hold it for two seconds, right? You're going to hold. One, two, and drop. Lift that body off. Good job, ladies. Next up, bear taps. Get ready for bear taps. Really working those upper body muscles. Woo. Okay, on your fours. Lift those knees. Let's go. Lift those knees up and tap. 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 Make sure you're looking at the ground. Look down. If this is too difficult, just stay. Just stay like this. Okay? Slow and steady. Breathe normally. Keep the core nice and tight. Please tuck that tummy in. Suck it in. Let's go. You got this. Nine seconds. You got this. Drop it. Rest, ladies. Oh. Last one is rocking plank and we are done with the workout. Take a break. Find your breath. Okay, I'm going on the mat. Get ready for plank. Let's go. In a straight plank, elbows underneath the shoulders. You're just going to rock. Do you see my feet? You're just going a slight movement back and forth. Beginners, drop those knees down and do this. Okay? No problem. Make sure you're looking between your hands. Advance, rock. I want a straight line from head to toe. Drop it, ladies. And you're done. Good job, ladies. You're done with the workout. Let me remove my shoes in a quick second. Okay, let's cool down. Let's cool down, ladies. <coughs> my throat is drying today. Okay, so what are we going to do? We're going to cool down. We'll start with wrist circles. Because I know you've really used your wrists. 
and many of the ladies kind of complain if they have poor wrists you know so you're gonna do wrist circles to feel that nice stretch you're gonna go counterclockwise the other way good job and then you're gonna press you see this you're gonna place the palm away from you you're gonna hold your fingers and you're gonna pull push it towards the body you're gonna push it slightly just put a slight pressure and push those fingers towards you palm facing away from you and push the fingers towards you you will feel a stretch here in the back feel that hold it it's a very slight pressure ladies you're not gonna go crazy with that it's just slight pressure the other one palm facing away from you fingers pulling towards you hold it good job ladies i'm gonna take my hands behind my back I'm going to show you from the side. I'm going to take my hands behind my back and I'm going to pull those hands away from the body. So I'm just going to pull it away from the body and I'm going to expand that chest. Look straight. Keep the core nice and tight. Tuck that tummy in. Okay, hands in front of you now. Again, you're going to pull it away from the body. So you're going to scoop out. It's so going to really work those shoulders and upper back, upper back. Pull it away, 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 away. My God, this feels so good. Stay there. Okay, now you're going to hug yourself. Just hug. Just hug yourself and just look down. This is also going to work your upper back and your neck. Basically, it's called arms across the chest. I just call it hug yourself. Okay. Uh, we're just going to do a cow let's do a cow stay there and then we're gonna do a step uh, uh, you're not gonna sit entirely we're gonna do a child pose but our glutes are not on the ground we're just gonna stretch ah uh, this feels so good extend those arms in front of you stay there and drop your hips down and you're going to do a classic child pose nose and forehead on the ground stay there breathe five deep breaths And we are done with the workout, ladies. I hope you had a good time. Take care of yourself. Don't forget to tag me so that I know you've done your workout. And remember me in your duas.